Your decal set will come with three separate decals, one for each battery. You can apply them in any order. You don't need to do one battery first before the other. Start by cutting the decals out separately. If you cut them as close as you can to the decal, it'll help line them up later. Peel the backing off the decal. Sometimes I don't want to stick to the decal. It'll be hard to get off the backing. When this happens, bend the backing sharply, right at the point where it's not coming up. To kind of push the decal while pulling the backing off. This might happen in a few spots on the decal. Just keep bending the backing. The goal is to keep the decal on the transfer tape. It doesn't have to be stuck permanently. The clear tape is simply a transfer tape for transferring the decal in its original design position. Line it up carefully over the surface. Don't let it touch the surface until you have it lined up perfectly, You're as close as you can get it. You really only get one shot at this. Try to eyeball it from top to bottom. And then push down one section. I normally do it in the middle. Rub the top, rub the bottom. If you have a squeegee like this, you can use it to rub the decal down to get a better adhesion. If not, you can use a license, credit card, or anything like that, or just rub it really good with your hands. When peeling the tape off, peel it back completely, 180 degrees. Don't pull straight up or to have a tendency to pull the decal up with it. You want the decal to stay down and the tape to come off. After you have the tape off, you can throw it away. Rub the decal a little bit more to make sure it's stuck everywhere. Give it a good adhesion. Repeat the process for the rest of the decals. Again, if it gets stuck on the backing, it doesn't want to come up. Bend that backing 180 degrees right at the problem area where the decal doesn't want to come up. You should be able to keep it on the transfer tape. Once it's off the backing, set it in place, rub it down. Take that transfer tape 180 degrees back again and pull it all the way off. There is a method of doing this wet. I don't use it too often, especially for small projects like this, but it will allow you more time to position the decal properly. You can look this up online. There are plenty of informational videos and websites on this technique. But in a nutshell, you can use soapy water on the surface and on the sticky side of the decal after the backing paper is removed. Then you apply the decal as usual and you'll have more time to apply it because it won't stick immediately. Then you let it dry and remove the transfer tape. Then you let it dry some more and then it's good.
What I didn't show in this video that you can also do is hit it with a hair dryer, maybe even a heat gun, but carefully. You don't want to melt anything. When you heat up the decal, it gives it a little better adhesion. There you have a complete set of Mavic decals.